Greetings everyone, this is Michael Walker, Digital Learning Specialist, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can use Google Forms as a template for digital notes that you might be taking in classes. And It might be a nice tool for those of you who like to take your notes digitally. I'd like to give a shout out to uh, Mr. Dahl over at Southview who came up with this template. So to access the template, if you go to tinyurl.com slash dignote, it will take you to the digital notes template. So go ahead and click on that. When the template comes up, you're going to want to go to the file menu and make a copy of it. And you can call it, uh, maybe it's science, digital notes, and maybe you want to put the unit in here so you know what unit it is, maybe it's unit one or whatever the topic happens to be, you can put that in there and click OK. And that's going to give you a new copy of this template. And the next thing we're going to want to do is save that in your the folder that you're using for that. So maybe I'll move it to a folder and I may have created a folder for uh, notes. Here's one. And I can even put it in the chapter one folder if that's where it happens to be. I'll move it in there. So that's where that those notes are going to reside in my Google Drive. Next thing you're going to do is go to the form menu. And we can edit the form. And you'll see that here's this form. I'm going to change this to science because that's what the topic happens to be. And now I've got that set. And once I have my um, information set here, I can go to view the live form. And now I have a Google form where I can put in the chapter, key term or concept, it might be the scientific method. Maybe I have a question about it. I can take my notes. And then at the very end of the day, as you're taking these notes, you can create a summary of what you've done. Now, perhaps here, maybe I'll talk about a uh, question here, what it's going to be. Um, question. Here's my notes. I have something there. And then I can say submit. And as I keep going, I can submit other responses, add more information. And back on my spreadsheet, all of these are going to show up here. Uh, right on my spreadsheet. So when it comes time to practice, I can cover up one side and cover up the concepts or the note and study the terms. And I have this in a nice format where I can go through and study the notes. So uh, give that digital notes a try and it can be a successful way for you to take your notes in class using the form right here. Uh, when you want to make a new one, you can go to make a copy, change it maybe to uh, social studies or whatever the class happens to be, and go in and edit the form a little bit, and then you can start taking notes in that class as well. Hopefully this will help you as you're taking digital notes with eLearning Squared.